charm to see everyone. Welcome back to Star Player One. I'm Brand Knight. Today we're continuing off with Song of Memories. The last thing we left off, we had a choice. Did we go straight home or did we walk through the park at night? I chose the park route, and luckily for me, we found Akira, who's surrounded by monsters, and our character is going to rush in and try to help her, protect her, basically. Music's playing? And sh is she singing? Huh? Is that... She's singing or I think she's singing. Isn't that a dream for you song? How does she know our songs? I'm digging it. Wow, she's holding off to the monsters with her singing. She's incredible. Oh, there's a third monster. <laughs> Too late. Watch her move. She had combat training. Hey, Brand, why are you just standing there? We need to save her. Oops, right, let's do it. Yeah, we, I'm gonna go and try to save her, duh. Oh my goodness, but I like to picture like when she's fighting the monster, it's like, you know, it's like those scenes in the romantic, like the romance movies where you like, you see it in slow motion, like the guy's just completely enthralled by her movements. That's what's going on. Again, this is not canon, this is in my mind. Let's save her. Akira, are you okay? It's you. Sit tight. I'll save you. Stay back. It's too dangerous. Ordinary citizens can't defeat the mutants. Lucky for you, I'm not an ordinary citizen. No need to worry. I have D for you on my side. Let's battle. Uh, we're gonna fight. Duh. Let's do an attack. Okay, Saka's leading the song. Let's have Karen join in. Fight. I gotta match the prompt. Ah! My HP! Ah! My HP! Let's sing, girls. I am loving the music in this game. Perfect! Ah, too early. I'm sorry, Saka. I'll get better at this. I've been playing rhythm games. Music really games recently, so this is right up my alley. Rhythm shock, I think I did it. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's let's try it again. Assume me sing with Misaki. Why the hell not? There's attributes I should be there's a there's more strategy I should be applying to this. But, you know. I miss, I'm sorry. Ah, oh, man, too early again. Perfect! Yes! Rhythm Shock again! Ain't got nothing on me! Hey, we all... We all leveled up! Don't know what we gained from that, but we leveled up! 
感謝しますおかげで助かりました Thanks for your help You really did save me there いえいえアキラさんを助けるつもりがかえってアキラさんに助けられちゃいましたよ Oh no don't say that You went up helping me more than I helped you ところでアキラさんどうして D4U の歌を歌えるんですか By the way, Akira, how did you know D4U's songs? あなたの協力には感謝していますですがそのことについてはお答えできません Night, I appreciate your assistance, but I cannot answer that question そんな <laughs> But では私はこれで失礼します If you excuse me ちょっと待ってくださいだったらせめてあの怪物の正体だけでも教えてくださいよ Wait a minute, can you at least tell me what those monsters are? are the mutants? They're connected to the virus. Virus? Virus? News has been doing numerous stories on it. Surely you heard of the virus. X 型ウイルス人間を凶暴化させるっていう。The news? Oh! You, you don't mean the X virus? The one that drives people mad? That's what I saw in the video on the internet. And sometimes the news talks about people having the virus overseas. そのように噂されることもありますね。とにかく、今の相手はそのウイルスと何らかの関連があるもの。Well, yes, those sort of rumors are going around. Anyway, the mutants we just fought are connected to that virus. And that's all you need to know. So you're saying that the virus has already made, it, made its way to Japan, to the city? It's not like a big deal? I don't remember saying that. The virus is an Udamari. But you just said. But I said they were connected. I did not say it was the virus itself. I see got those monsters and I have the ability to fight them. But you also. If you use that mysterious app in your device, you might even be more powerful than I. I wouldn't go that far. We make a good team. She means the for you, sons. Anyway, those monsters you just saw are a manifestation of the targets connected to the virus. That's all you need to know. Huh. Yoku Akarima Senkedo. Ja, Kiken wa nain deska. Okay. I don't really get it, but. So, they're not dangerous? Sister, Kiken o Mizen y Hajo Sirinoga. What does no Yakumetis? Not for now, no. It's my job to dispose of them before they become dangerous. Maybe we can help? Maybe? I don't know. Oh, so that's what's going on. I thought she had a dark side to her, but. Well, if you'll excuse me. Okay, thanks. Akira's gone. Mm. I don't really get what just happened. Aker seems to know a lot, but you. But why won't she tell me anything? Probably because it's national government secrets, is what I'm gonna guess. After Aker left, I decided to talk to D4U for a while in the park. Let's talk to. Rico! I decided to talk to Rico. She didn't end up telling me she didn't end up telling me what that monster thing was. So ne Ano Yosudato, Hokanimo she did a cotto, Ariso da Kido. 
Yeah, she looked like she knew. She knows a lot of things that she's not telling you. Well, yeah, that monster was clearly not normal. I wouldn't be surprised if it was top secret. Even so, I suddenly look at the device that holds the for you. That song Akira was just singing. It was just like your songs, wasn't it? You thought so too. I thought it sounded the same too. It even worked against the monster. Mmm. She seems to be in. She seemed to be in trouble before we stepped in. So maybe Akira's song isn't as powerful as C4U's. The Akira song did work against that monster, so I guess it's not who sings the song that matters, but the song itself. But the real question is, how does Akira know your songs? I don't even know how we know our own songs, so I can't say. Riko doesn't seem to remember, but maybe Akira had something to do with D4U before I found him. Well, it's no use obsessing over it anymore today. Yeah, worrying won't solve anything. You should get home soon. Fuku and Ken will be worried. They probably would be. It's been quite a while since I left to go shopping, so I quickly jog out of the park. Night ends with a lot of things still shrouded in mystery. But we gotta see you back here, so you know. You take what you can get. October 11th. The main character's classroom. It's lunchtime. Ah, <sighs> oh, finally lunchtime. I'm so tired. <laughs> Says the guy who slept for most of his morning classes. So where should we eat? It's a nice day, maybe the quad? Where do you want to eat, Makoto? Did you bring a lunch from home? Yeah, I'm gonna eat here, like I always do. I need to watch over Yuno as she elegantly dines with her classmates. That's not creepy at all. Nah, they lie. That's actually a little creepy. Yep, creepy and to the point. Call it off before you get caught. What'd you say? I'll start by giving Satsuki a tip off. Uh, please refrain from doing so, my comrade. What am I doing wrong? I'm just watching over Yuno know, from afar, with virtuous intentions. I suddenly reach for my phone. <laughs> Hey, seriously, don't do it. I'm not doing anything bad. I'm just watching over a girl I admire. And. Okay, I understand. So now I'll watch over my friend freaking out over Sasuke. Please, I mean it. Uh, just try not to actually get caught, okay? I'm going. I'm just gonna leave. I'm gonna be a part of this. That really tires me out. Jeez. Okay. Let's eat lunch outside today. Oh, Brandon. Doesn't usual. I never see you outside the gym. Did you come here to see one of the second years? No, uh, I didn't. I hope I'm wrong here, and I really do. 
But did you come here to watch over you know she eats lunch? Why are you looking away? Jeez, at least let her eat her lunch in peace. Come on, lunch just started. You haven't eaten yet, right? Oh, uh, actually, I already ate. For real? Wow, you don't look like a fast eater. Well, slow down, okay? You don't want to get fat. I'll be fine. I'm actually on a little diet right now, so I didn't have much for lunch. Hmm. Hmm, but you don't look like you need to lose weight. Well then again, the uniforms here leave much to the imagination. And Natsumi's chest looks pretty big. Maybe she just looks thinner when she's dressed. Mm. Brandon? <laughs> Never mind, it's nothing. Really? Oh, but even if it was nothing, it was rude of me to stare at you like that. Sorry. Oh, it's okay. I'm sorry I spoke out of turn. You were thinking about something. Well, I was thinking about something stupid and sexist, so I'm... So I'm actually glad you snapped me out of it. But naturally, I don't tell her that. In any case, I was more at fault than that to me. I don't understand why she's being more up... up no, oh, jeez. Apologetic? Apologetic. There we go! Is she really just... Is she just really nice, or is she... Brandon? Oh, uh, never mind. Anyway, you wanted to go see Yuno, right? She's probably finishing up her lunch about now. No, that's okay. I wasn't here to see her. Oh, goodness. Why would I see Yuna for no reason? Oh. What's wrong, Natsumi? Why are you wobbling? Oh, uh, it's nothing. Okay, sorry. I was just fantasizing having a one-on-one -on -one talk with Yuno. And I was overcome with such joy that I lost my foot in. Mm. If an outsider heard Natsumi talk, they'd probably think Yuno was some powerful drug. <laughs> Sorry, I'm sounding creepy, aren't I? I'm sorry, I'm probably putting you off. No, don't say that, but I'm surprised. You really do love Yuno, don't you? Come to think of it, that's the only thing I know about you. Me? Oh, there's something special to know about me. Comparing you to me is like comparing the moon to a frog. No, a water flea. You go that far? <laughs> You're funny, Natsumi. You're devoted and passionate. I envy you for that. So, 
しかして私先輩にとても失礼だったり恥ずかしいところを見られちゃってます do, do you? But aren't I being awfully rude and embarrassing myself? <laughs> おかしいです私男の人と喋るのって苦手な方なんですけど先輩が相手だとついたくさんおしゃべりしちゃって Oh, oh, I know I'm really awkward. I'm just really bad at talking to boys. But I find myself babbling when I'm around you. Well, we can't have a charm about us, I like to think. Yeah, definitely okay. So, I'm sorry. 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 ごめんなさい。なんだか長話をさせちゃって。お、oh, ブレン、Oops、You're about to have your lunch, weren't you? I'm so sorry, I kept you away。そうだったな。危うく昼休みが終わっちゃうところだった。じゃあ、俺は昼ご飯食べに行くけど。All right, I totally almost forgot to eat lunch. Okay, I guess I'll go eat lunch then. ユノを追い回すのもいいけど、先生に叱られない程度にしておけよ、夏ね。Well, following you around is harmless enough. Just make sure your teacher doesn't yell at you. Oh, uh, Brandon? Oh, 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 I don't have a teacher to yell at me, so, um, if you're okay with it, um, maybe we could, uh, you know, but I'm not that. Not to be fun, I was trying to say something. Wait. She said maybe we could. Was she trying to say what I think she was trying to say? No, never mind, I'm sorry. Well, can I ask you a question? Yes. I'm going to go to the house. 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 I was planning on eating lunch right now, but I don't want to eat alone. It's pretty gloomy. I'm going to go to the house. 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 I know you already ate, but would you mind sitting with me? I know that might be a tough request for a girl who's been trying to eat less. Yes, I'm fine. I'm fine. I can't do anything interesting about it. I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh, yes. If you wouldn't mind. I don't think I'm a very interesting conversationalist, but I'll do my best. No, no. I'm just talking about it. It's fine. I'm 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 fine. Oh no, it's cool. Just talking the way you normally do is interesting enough. Especially when you talk about you know. That stuff's entertaining. There we go. So, 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 so yeah, you are entertaining. So, I was going to eat outside, since the weather is nice. Do you have any other ideas? Um, if you want to sit in the sun, how about the roof? Okay, it's fine. Okay, the roof it is. I'll guide you to the rooftop. Cafe. I mean, a special area on the academy roof. Yay! Hmm, you're so nice. Hmm, the weather really is nice today. It's all warm and sunny. Hmm, the weather really is nice today. It's all warm and sunny. Yeah. And we got this bench just as it got freed up. Well, time to eat. 
お弁当も喜んでる気がします先輩のお弁当本当に美味しそうですね香りがここまで来ているような I think your lunch is happy it gets to be eaten under the sunshine as well your lunch really does look delicious I can smell it all the way from over here what do you want to bite? そんな顔をしてもあげないぞダイエット中なんだろう夏目は Don't make that face. I'm not giving you any. You're on a diet. Now that's kind of direct me. So, that's so なんですけど。そういえばユノ先輩って料理はどれくらいできるんでしょう。Well, yes, but I was just wondering how good of a cook you know was. あどうだったかな。一通りできたとは。Hmm. Let's see. I think she's pretty average, but. 一流レストランのシェフには勝てないかもしれませんがすぐにでも厨房に立てるぐらいとは思うんですよね。あんたはマスター、マスター、シェフレベル。でも、私たちは、マスター、マスター、シェフレベル。たぶん、食材の目利きもバッチリご自分でして。いい玉ねぎだね。飴色になるまで炒めれば、ルーにコクが出るはず。とか言ったり。She's probably an excellent judge of ingredient quality. I can hear her now. My, what lovely onions you are. If I brown you, the rooks will be delicious. Oh, curry? Oh, she's making curry? So, she's making curry. 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 Then she makes a perfect dinner and would treat her family to a full course meal when they come home. Curry じゃなかったっけ Oh, it wasn't curry. Yuku Yuku は料理の巨匠とかになられたり Ah, 先輩 Then in time, she would master her kitchen skills, and oh, you know, you are a kitchen goddess. This is a hundred percent Natsume's fantasy. Though, yeah, she's definitely very entertaining. So, n a t a you know, you're a kitchen goddess. Oh, yeah, she's definitely very entertaining. So, n a t a you know, you're a kitchen goddess. Oh, yeah, she's definitely very entertaining. And that's how the rest of my lunch with Natsumi goes. Jeez, that was a long conversation. Long lunch. I can go home now. Yay! I'll walk through the park. Again! <laughs> ah, the day is finally over. What should I do now? Satsuki's classroom, gym, school gate. Uh, school gate. I don't feel like going to the. I don't feel like going to the gym. I'm not working out. And I had really no intention to go to Sassy's classroom. I see no reason to go. Let's go to school gate. Oh, hey! Academy bell rings, signaling the day's end. As soon as the teacher walks out of the classroom, everyone leans back and relaxes. The rest of the boys next to yours, truly! Phew, I'm wiped. Finally, we're done with that boring class. I feel like he slept for half of it. He's been leaning back and relaxing all day. Well, don't argue semantics. As long as I don't fail the class, I'm golden, right? Says the king of Fs. I'm not getting Fs anymore, so it's no big deal. Big words, kings of that, king of Fs. What's most important now is going to the gym to watch the gymnastics team practice, right? On that note, I'm off. Come with me, Brand. Let's revel in the bloom of youth together. Absolutely! No! I, and I'm surprised that Satsuki hasn't scared you off for good right Hey, you know the saying, right? Whoever doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Oh, she's killing you, little by little. Well, anyway, I'll pass. Have fun with your fan club, brothers. 
Don't lock me, fan club VP. I never agreed to join, and why am I suddenly the vice president? Overcompensating much? You always supported gymnastics, which makes you a perfect VP. Well, yeah, I do support her, but I feel like being her fan club would only make me lose points. And he's, I'm right, I would lose points. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, lose points to the ladies, of course. Okay, well, I'll, meet, I'll just mark you absent at today's meeting then. Oh, hi, Brandon. Are you and Makoto hanging out after the academy today? Gan shows up just in time to see me arguing with Makoto. She looks back and forth at us and gives us a strange look. Actually, I was just turning him down. This guy, I usually go watch Yuno practice after academy. After school, basically. We usually go watch her. Bran's trying to act all cool and aloof, like he doesn't care. A man should be ashamed to vocalize what he wants. You could use a little more shame. Sheesh. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> you guys really are good friends, aren't you? Hell yeah, we're BFFs. Hint, hint. Ugh, uh, so Cannon, did you want something from me? Alright, there's some place I wanted to swing by, so I was wondering if you wanted to walk home with me, if you're free. Ooh, a hangout, a hangout invite from a girl? Nope, you're not invited. Nope, I'm not invited. Of course, my mistake. And even if, I have, even if I've been invited, I can't turn my back on Yuno. Ah! If only I had a clone of myself! Run away so fast when an outline of your body hovers in the air. That's the best advice I can give you, man. Ha! <laughs> Makoto sure is a funny guy. So, you wanted to walk home together. I don't mind, since we're both going the same way, and we both live at the same place. But I don't want to get dizzy and follow down on the way, so we should try not to wander off t too far off course. Well, I'm sure she doesn't want to wander far. Thanks, Brandon. Okay, Makoto, see you tomorrow. Oh, if you're going to see you, know, tell her I say good luck. Uh, if he even tries to talk to you, know, I'm sure Satsuki will. Uh, I'll give it a try, yeah. Yeah, even if Sasuke doesn't notice me, the other team members will probably beat me up. Probably. Wherever you get going, see ya, Brandon. Cannon. Kuro swings his book bag over his shoulders and walks out of the classroom. He's probably heading straight for the gym. Guess we better head out, too. Sure. So where do you want to swing by? What to find out where you want to swing by in the next episode. So I hope you guys are liking it. We had a long conversation with Natsume. Learned a little more about her and her apparent obsession. Almost on par, I would say, with Makoto over Yuno. Which is interesting. I still... There's, there's mystery around that girl. I don't know if she's just shy. Seems like every time we try to introduce her to our friends, she just is nowhere to be seen. 
So, if you guys would, enjoy your lunch, and press that subscribe button right down below. Leave a like, comment if you guys would as well. And as always, I'll see all of you in the next Starfighter 1 episode. Bye!